Hey guys, Harsh here and welcome back to Technolobe. Now, often time as tech reviewers, we come across some products which are very different and can be very useful for you guys out there. And that's why making such videos is a lot of fun and today is one of those days. So today we are talking about a smart plug. Now when I say the word smart, you might be thinking that it has Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and you know Amazon Alexa or Google Assistant, but it's not that. It is smart in the sense that it can handle voltage fluctuations. So yes, voltage fluctuation is a real problem and it can damage your appliances in your home or office and it can damage all the expensive appliances as well. So your refrigerators, ACs, mobiles, laptops, etc, etc. It can potentially damage those devices and that's why it is very important to protect your devices from voltage fluctuations and that's where this product comes in. So this smart plug can handle voltage fluctuations in a very good way. So it has a safe operating range that is from 170 volts to 270 volts. And if the voltage fluctuates above 270 or it goes below 170, then the power will be cut off. So essentially you will be connecting this smart plug to the wall and then connect your appliance to this smart plug. And as soon as the voltage goes above 270 or below 170, your appliance will shut down because of the smart plug. Now let me show you a quick demo with a test kit and a voltage multimeter. So as soon as the voltage goes above 270, you can see that the power has been cut off. Now when the voltage drops back to the safe range that is between 170 and 270, you can see that the power has been resumed, but it has a startup delay of 5 seconds. So as soon as it comes back to the safe range after 5 seconds, your appliance will start. Now same goes below 170. As soon as the voltage goes below 170, the power will be cut off. And again, when it comes back to the safe range, the power will resume after five seconds. So yeah, it has a startup delay of five seconds, which is very important to protect your devices. And that is actually very smart. So all this is being done inside the plug itself. And that is very good. Now this smart plug is not a voltage stabilizer by any means. It's a completely different product and the working of this product is also different. So please do not confuse it with a voltage stabilizer. Now there are a lot of variants of this smart plug depending upon the appliance that you want to connect it to. So there are three main variants that is one is with 6 amperes, the other one 16 amperes and the third one is 6 amperes especially designed for refrigerators. So refrigerators have a startup delay up to 180 seconds because it is recommended. So if you want to buy it for a refrigerator then you can buy that variant. Now all these variants have two types that is one is with cord and the other one is without cord. So if you don't have a lot of space on the switchboard then you can buy the one with the cord and then you can connect your appliances to the smart plug. Now you can also connect this smart plug to something like an extension board and then use all your appliances with it. So yeah it does work with an extension board as well. Now please make a note that you can use this smart plug with single phase devices. So if your device has multiple phases, then you will have to use multiple smart plugs. So for example, if you have three phases, then you will have to use three of these smart plugs. So it works that way. So overall, this smart plug is very smart and it is useful for a lot of us out there. So if you have ever noticed voltage fluctuation or if you have the problem in your area or in your city, then you can definitely go ahead and buy this product and it will definitely help your appliances and it will keep them safe. If you want to buy them, I'll drop a link in the description box below. So anyway, that's been it. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope that it helped you out in some way or the other. And if it did, then please let me know about that in the comment section down below. Also, if you haven't yet, please subscribe below because it would mean the world to me. My name is Harsh Punjabi and I'll see you guys in the next one.